you guys are the type of people that like that sweet, desserty, amazing type of juice. Well, I got the juice for you. Hey guys, today I'm going to be doing a review on Epic Clouds' Donut Pounder. This is a 3 milligram juice. Um, I picked it up from a local vape shop that just came in. It's called The Vaping. And, uh, man, that smells so good. And, uh, it was around, they all come in these, uh, 30 mil plastic bottles. It looks, it's a dark bottle. The juice really isn't that dark. The juice is kind of a yellowish color. But, uh, they all come in this bottle about 13 to 15 bucks, which isn't too bad. This new store that came in, the vaping, I don't know if I mentioned that already, but they sell a lot of the new, uh, premium juice lines like Cutwood, uh, Sick Boy, Epic Clouds, uh, you name it. Pretty much they got most of the premium juice. Um, yeah, I picked up, I was trying a bunch of their flavors, and this uh, donut pounder really stuck out to me. I brought my RDA in just so I could drip it up and try some try some different flavors. Uh, oopsie. But, yeah, I brought my RDA in, started trying some flavors, and definitely had to pick that stuff up. Figured I would do a review on it, excuse me, for you guys and let you guys know what I thought about it. Well, I'm going to give it a little VTF, Vapor Production, Throat Hit, and Flavor, in a 1 out of 10 rating, 1 being the lowest, 10 being the highest, and I will be vaping this through my eye stick and a uh, Kanger sub tank with a point, point 0.5 ohm build on 30 watts. Uh, this is Max DG Juice, and I'm probably going to switch to my Doge RDA here later. And show you guys the vape production out of an RDA. Well, let's start with vapor. Alright, I'm going to kind of stand back a little bit so you guys can see. you guys can see it's a chuck in it i mean it chucks it with a sub tank i mean this is an rta this is not an rda it has a 0.5 ohm single coil build in here with japanese cotton um it chucks the vapor vapor overall rating is going to have to get a solid nine out of ten this i mean the juice is literally called epic clouds for a reason it clouds it up i mean this whole room is clouded my, this is my little brother's room but it's completely clouded. I'm staying with uh, staying with my mom right now at the time. Uh, gonna figure out stay in my little brother's room while he's away, and do some do some vape videos, huh? What do you think about that? All right. Next thing we're going to talk about is the throat hit, and this is the downside about this juice. Okay, so I'm the type of guy that likes the thump, the thump in the back of your throat, the harshness in the chest of the juice. I mean, people may argue and say, well, you're not getting that because there's no PG in it, or you're not getting that because it's not 6 milligrams, or something like that. Well, I have had plenty of Max VG 3 milligram juices that still give me the thump that I need in the back of my throat. Plenty. I mean, so many different juices. Let's see. A lot of Mount Baker Vapors juices, they kill you with that throat hit, and I love it. I love the throat hit. I love the pound, but not to where it's too hard. To where it's just going to choke you out. To where it's just, you feel it, you know it's there, and you feel like it's right. That's what you want. That's what I want. Overall throat hit on this. Two mouths long. Throat hit on this, I'm probably going to give... I would say a 4 out of 10. I do not, I mean, it's, if you're the type of person that likes a smooth, smooth vape and a little on the light side, really on the light side, then that's definitely the type of juice for you. I mean, honestly, it kind of tastes like there's no nicotine in it, but I know that there obviously is because I feel satisfied after I hit it, just not with the throat hit. I mean, I'm satisfied on a nicotine level, but not on the throat hit level. Make sense? All right, next we're going to talk about the flavor. 
the flavor on this guys is kick ass teetotally kick ass it's a kind of reminds me of honestly a donut custard if that makes sense it's a custardy type donut flavor i mean it's a very very delicious flavor i would recommend it to any vapor whether you're experienced you know if you're a beginner whatever it's a delicious juice and it's not too sweet where it's going to kill you all day i could definitely vape it all day if it had more of a throat hit to it sorry i'm gonna grab a drink but um it's more of a more of a morning vape for me i could say it's a morning vape because once when i get up in the morning i don't like something that's going to kill me on the throat because i'll start coughing real hard and that's no good but definitely could be a nice morning vape with a cup of coffee and just sit out on the porch maybe eight nine in the morning listen to the birds sweet summertime drinking your cup of coffee black with the lots of sugar and pounding that donut pounder sounds delicious to me um, another thing that I'm going to do real fast and we'll be right back and I'll show you alrighty guys I slid on this doge RDA onto my eye stick and it's got just a parallel 26 gauge 0.4 ohm coil in it uh, I believe that there's 10 wraps all together or 12 wraps all together including the double so six wraps you know six wraps but 12 all together uh, I'm going to step back a little bit and just show you guys the vapor that this thing trucks out in the RDA with just a, on, here, let's crank it up to, we'll put her on 40 watts. As you can see, Chuck's clouds. I mean, killer, killer clouds, guys. Overall rating on this juice, I'm going to have to give it, I'm going to say a 7.5 out of 10. It is a great juice, but the throat hit just isn't there for me, guys. I mean, like I said, if you're a smooth, smooth type of juice kind of person, then definitely you would enjoy the shit out of this juice. But I love it. It could be an all-day vape for me, but it's more of a morning to afternoon vape. Um, definitely not an all-day. Uh, it could be for some people. Definitely could could be. Um, it's a delicious taste, delicious vapor, and just overall juicy, juicy flavor in it. But thanks a lot, guys. Uh, definitely recommend you guys picking up this juice. 13 to 15 bucks for it. It's a premium e-liquid. Great taste. Uh, check out Epic Cloud's juice line, guys. Uh, Definitely, definitely, I'd say they got some great flavors out there. I know they got a real good strawberry, champagne, and another strawberry, and I think they have some, they got some blueberry, I think. I don't know. They got a bunch of different, uh, like five or six different flavors at my retailer, the, vape, the vaping. They had five or six different flavors there, but pick it up, guys. Let me know what you guys think about the video and my quality and how I did everything. So thanks a lot. And I'm going to crank this down before I hit it with my RTA on it. And Vapeson is out. Dose!